Hi, my name is Abby Wilt and I'm one of the kindergarten teachers here at Emanuel Christian School. We wanted to make a video to show you the day in the life of a kindergarten student so you can know how your little will be spending their time here at ECS. We ask that our students arrive at 8 a.m. because we meet as an entire school for prayer and announcements in the gym. This is a great way to connect and fellowship with one another and hear what's happening at our school. This also allows us to start the day on the right foot. School begins promptly at 8.10 and we ask that the students are in their seats and ready to rock and roll by this time. We cover three main subjects here at ECS, math, Bible, and phonics. Our Bible curriculum is called Purposeful Design and it tracks and teaches stories and events that happen in the Bible. It helps us understand how much God loves us and His perfect plan for us. It teaches about salvation and that we are sinners and that we need Christ to be the center of our lives. We spend a week learning a Bible story or topic, and they also learn a Bible verse. That way, we are walking in the Word every day. The math curriculum that we use here in kindergarten is called Saxon Math. It is a spiral curriculum that allows us to teach multiple topics in a week and constantly review them so that we're not just teaching one topic for a month and then never going back to it. This allows the students to be constantly learning and relearning concepts so that they are fresh in their minds. We use Bob Jones curriculum for our phonics and ELA. This has been our first year using this curriculum, and I can't tell you how exciting it has been to see how deep these kindergartners are able to go into the world of ELA. They are reading at such a high level for the end of the year kindergartner, and I'm very proud of them. This curriculum has made it very possible for us to teach these kiddos the foundational tools needed for reading. Our afternoons are spent on enrichment activities. This is where we tap into science and social studies. These concepts are taught by themes, experiments, crafts, and other fun activities that keep the students' minds engaged and allows us to be sneaky. They think that they're playing and having fun, but really they're learning so many important concepts and skills. We have a scheduled recess in the morning around 10 a.m. This will allow the students to play with their friends and also enjoy a nice snack. Then we have lunch at 12 o'clock and another recess following after that. The first semester and two weeks after Christmas breaks, we allow the kids to have a rest time. This is where they can recharge and steady their minds to handle the rest of the afternoon like champs. They don't have to sleep, but we do say that they have to lay still and focus on resting. During this time, we usually play music or a story or just something to take their minds off of school for a minute so that they can refocus their bodies and minds and end the day on a good note. Students attend specials throughout the week, such as music, PE, art, computers, and library. During this time, they are able to explore the different avenues of arts and also learn about the different talents that God has given them. Our school day ends around 2.50 and the students are sent home with very little homework. Maybe just a two minute handwriting activity, a five minute math worksheet, and of course they are always encouraged to spend time reading and practicing their sight words. If you're watching this and thinking, oh man, my little might not be ready for that kind of day, Never fear, we've launched a new program last year called TK. This is a transitional kindergarten, two-track kindergarten year. This is meant for kids who might need to just dip their toes in before diving into a full kindergarten day. It is a full kindergarten day, and it's spent learning kindergarten curriculum. They're doing everything that a kindergartner would do. However, it's slowed down just enough so that they can focus more on social and emotional development. That way, your child is ready to succeed the following year when they start real kindergarten. We do go on several field trips throughout the year, whether it be to the art museum, the fire museum, the Valentine Theater, or the zoo. We even have some in-school field trips that are planned with companies or groups that come to our classes individually so that the students can get one-on-one -on -one attention. Speaking of one-on-one -on -one attention, our classes are capped at 20 kids in kindergarten so that we can focus on each student individually meeting their specific needs. We have fan a fantastic intervention team that is here to help us either meet the needs of the kiddos who are struggling or provide us with ideas to help those who are ready for a push to go a little deeper. As you can see here at Emmanuel Christian School, we focus on the whole child. We want them to be strong in their faith and we want them to be academically challenged we want them to be students of great character. We've launched a virtual admissions website to help you during this admission season. Visit ecstoledo.org and apply today. Kindergarten is a first come, first serve program, so make sure to apply and save your spot. If you have any questions at all, feel free to email admissions at ecstoledo.org. I hope this has answered all of your questions and you have a better feel on how your little will be spending their day here at ECS. We hope to meet you soon and we can't wait to see you in the fall so we can officially welcome you to Warrior Nation.